But um, yeah, well, I've been at the, I was at the three finals we lost, so I thought, well, we'll see what it's like when we win one. Uh, but no, I was relieved at the end because um, we had two eight points leads and we did our best to throw them away. Um, but fair play to the lads, they got they got there in the end and they deserved it. To be honest, I think if we had waited three weeks for a replay, we probably would have lost it. I think it'd been very hard for them to come come back again. Can you describe to me how you felt in the final whistle went? Well. When you have, um, you know, there are stages of grief, but they're all the stages of joy. And the stages of joy are re uh, relief, happiness, then a bit of anger, why they put you through that hell for the last 10 minutes. But no, um, I'm, I know a couple, uh, one of the lads now, right, and uh, happy for him now because, you know, especially because he lost two finals, a uh, minor and a senior, uh, Seamus Hickey. So I'm delighted for him anyway. I was there in 73 as well. I was there in 74. I was there in 1980. I was there from all. And a lot of heartache, 96, 94. Did you not have any fear that it was looking like 94 coming up to the end of it? I did, yeah. When they got to, when, uh, when they got to goal. We had a son in that one. Did you? Who was your son? Well, you did. Barry Foley. And, and tell me a little bit about that. Oh, it was nerve wracking. It really was now. I mean, they had to win up the last few minutes and Nixon just went away from us. Heartbreaking. How long did it take to bounce back from that in the 90s? Well... Oh my God, I suppose ages. He's, he's very, um, Barry's very reserved and um, and he just gets on with it. I suppose what choice have you to do but just to get on with it, you know, and just to keep going. And the pride in this team and the achievements of this team and the work that John Kiley and his team have done um, is phenomenal. And the pride that it has brought to the city. I mean, look around you, look at the crowds, the atmosphere. I think every single individual in Croom today was smiling, including Barry Foley. How did you feel when the final whistle went? I looked around for the defibrillator first, you know, just to be sure that there was one close by. But um, no, it was absolutely fantastic. Um, the tears just flew down my face. Um, it's just amazing, absolutely amazing. And so proud of them. Just so proud of the boys and so proud of the team. I'd imagine you're of the vintage as well, that you remember the hurt over the years, especially the 90s and the noughties. I have, yeah. Yeah, I've been there. I've, I have been there all the time. I've been there through the good times, the bad times. The everything and just yesterday was payback for all those days. So where were you sitting? And the Celtic stand. And what did you think of the game? Very good. What was so good about it? Um, the goals and they won everything. Just, I, I was at the 73 All Ireland when I was only 11 years of age at the time. I was and 14 months. 14 months. It hardly remember. You had that one. But <laughs> yesterday when we came outside the grounds, we made Pat Hartigan. We made Richie Binnis, you know, J.P. McMahon is another great man for the job. And only for these people, and I probably won't ever again see one. Well, I hope I do next year. <laughs> How hard is it to get tickets? Very hard. How did you get them? Um, I got two through our club, and uh, I got um, one from our cousin. She, she went to Hill 16, and we were two of us went to Hogger's Stand, and she loved the Hill 16. You were on the hill. Was it, what was that like? And they started jumping up and down and shoving each other. And what were you doing at that point? Um, her cousin was walking out of her. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and then the final whistle went. Did the hill go absolutely bananas at that point? Yeah. And then what happened? They started banging at the fence. <laughs> Hey, hope you enjoyed that latest offering from Off The Ball. If you want to subscribe, and you should, check out just up here. All our latest stuff is just down here. Generally, knock yourself out.